Welcome on back. It's the Playback Awards show. Basketball, we had a ton of girls teams competing hard, showing off their skills. We can only have one team be our team of the year. Let's meet them. The Mountain View girls had a historic run this year. The Cougars won the IMC title for the first time in program history and made it to the state quarterfinals. Congrats to Mountain View. You are the Big Playbacks Girls Basketball Team of the Year. Senior Allie Neat joins me here in Studio Allie, your senior season. I mean, how did it feel to, to play the way you guys did this year? It's been amazing just to be part of something, I mean, being part of history and being part of a team that's so special. And did you think maybe four years ago if you were ever going to tear down those nets? Absolutely not. <laughs> and what was racing through your mind when you were able to kind of hold that in your hand and, and make that, at least that run to get to a state quarterfinals? It was amazing just being able to cut the nets down for the first time in history. It was just so surreal. Well, you guys were a fun bunch to watch. and was certainly a season to be proud of. Our girls basketball team of the year, the Mountain View Cougars, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Congratulations. All right, we had some great teams on the boys' side as well, and this team should have a lot of pride. Let's meet our boys' basketball team of the year. The Summit Storm basketball team put the state on notice. With a junior heavy lineup, the Storm won the IMC title and made it all the way to the state finals. Summit had two all-state tournament players in Pearson Carmichael and Colin Moore. Congrats to the Summit Storm. You were the Big Playbacks Boys Basketball Team of the Year. Senior Hogan Carmichael joins me now in the studio. Hogan, you guys fell just short of the ultimate goal, but still a season to be proud of. I mean, what impressed you about this year's team? What probably impressed me the most is that we had a lot of ups and downs this year. And, you know, like we lost. We lost a few games in the middle of the season. We didn't have our best stretch, and, you know, we bounced back, and we were a stronger team. Then we were trying to team after the fact, and that's I think what impressed me the most. Absolutely, and you've said it before, but we'll say it again. Give, give me some praise for your younger brother. I mean, he's really good. I don't think there's anyone in the state who does it better than him, and I know he's going to be a problem next year. Absolutely, I'm excited to see that. But Hogan, congrats on your prestigious career at Summit, both in basketball and of course in football, and best of luck in that next step for you. But here to represent the basketball team, our boys basketball team of the year. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, up next, it's the best part of the night. We reveal our legendary play of the year. Which one is it? Don't you go anywhere. 